OpenAI has a rumored trillion dollar IPO and NVIDIA hits $5 trillion in market cap. What's the real story here? It's actually not the rumored IPO, although that was news that went around the world. The real story is that OpenAI is unbundling the tech stack, and that is part of how they are reaching this valuation. They have reached an appetite for compute that exceeds even Microsoft's cloud's capability to deliver. And so they are unbundling and they have dropped the Microsoft first right of refusal on compute, and they can now get compute from anywhere, from Oracle, from Google, from elsewhere. That might seem like it's strange because some of the folks like Google make their own models, but we already see Anthropic and Google working together. The bottom line is not who ends up in a deal with who. The bottom line is that everybody is in a race to build infrastructure. And if you want to look at when the next great model comes out from Gemini or from OpenAI or from Anthropic, the answer is increasingly not dependent on researchers doing smart things with models. It's dependent on people getting chips into data centers with power because researchers keep communicating and leadership at these companies keeps communicating. We're not blocked on progress. We're blocked on chips. We're blocked on the ability to get enough chips into data centers to serve demand. As I called out earlier in the week, that incredible appetite for AI is part of how we know we're not in a bubble. This is getting built out to serve a backlog of existing demand. And that demand has no signs of slowing down. It turns out the world has near infinite appetite for intelligence.